The estate representative is looking for answers. Who stole more than a dozen of his campaign signs? The incident happened last Friday, and you can see nearby cameras captured someone taking those signs down. Yeah, that's happened along U.S. 17 in the northern part of Putnam County. News Redacts reporter Khalil Maycock joins us live now from where some of the signs were taken. Khalil, that candidate was out late last night trying to replace them. Yeah, Ashley, he said since they recently came in, he was out late last night and into early this morning putting some of those signs back up. And that's what they look like over there. But I want to take your attention and focus it on this fence right here. This is where one of his signs used to be. You can see that it's no longer there, but zip ties are holding up remnants of what was there. This is Judson Sapp rewatching the video of someone stealing one of his campaign signs. The video is blurry, but if you look at the highlighted portion of your screen, you can see someone hop out of this car, grab the sign from the fence, put it in the car, and then drive off. Watching this back, how does that make you feel? Well, it's upsetting. Judson Sapp is one of two Republicans running in the primary to represent Florida House District 20. This covers Putnam and parts of Clay, St. John's, and Marion counties. Sapp says this sign that was taken on video last Friday is one of 13 stolen. Do you think this is kind of along the lines of political sabotage? In this case, yes, I do. I do. It was just too organized. He also says the signs taken were his large ones, which he estimates to each be worth over $100. And Sapp says this isn't the first time his signs were stolen. About four weeks ago, he says some were taken in Wallaca. After speaking with Sapp, I reached out to the Putnam County Sheriff's Office to see if they'd had any other reports of political candidates having their campaign items stolen and asked if someone is caught what could happen. They replied saying, as of now, we do not have any reports of other political signs being damaged or stolen. Often candidates fix the signs and don't report. Theft of a sign is a misdemeanor. There are no enhanced charges or additional charges for campaign signs. I also reached out to the Putnam County Supervisor of Elections asking about this, and they said missing or vandalized campaign signs are not uncommon during election season. Yeah, I just like to see the bar elevated. People need to respect the process, and when you're angry, don't take it out like that. Because he says this was not the right thing to do. And Sab says he is offering a reward for anyone who can provide information to find that person on the video. And I did reach out to the other candidates who are running in the same race as Sap to see if they had any comment or wanted to say anything. I'm still waiting to hear back. Reporting live, Clil Maycock, Channel 4, The Local Station.